Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. My name is Mommy. And today we're gonna play Cube World Alpha. Very, very excited to play this. I bought this yesterday, but I didn't have time to record, so I actually live stream for a bit. Um, it's gonna make a new character. I learned how to play somewhat. Um, if you don't know what Cube World is, you're in for a freaking treat. So this is my character that I'm gonna use on live streams. So uh, I'm gonna do three different things with Cube World while I'm making my character. Let me explain it. Let's see, race. I'm gonna be yeah, elf. Okay, so I'm gonna do a live stream character. I'm going to do a single player character, which is gonna be this series right on my YouTube, and then on the YouTube again, I'll have another series with a multiplayer character. So uh, that will be up as soon as my friends get around to getting it too. So for now, let's go ahead and just play. This is okay. It was close alpha. Now it's a regular alpha. Um, so I think I'll make this character warrior because hell yeah, I love warriors. Face. Um, all my characters like if I can, I usually like to have like. Orangey, lightish hair, so let's do that. Face. Oh, that's cool. So, yeah, I'm gonna be Elf. So he's pretty tall. Elf? Nah, let's see what else he can do. Dwarf. Orc. Whoa. What the? Goblin? Lizard. Undead. Frogman. Let's see. I'm thinking un either Lizard. Wow, well, he doesn't really have any armor on him. You know what? Stick with the human. Just because I'm used to that in games like this. And, uh, can I change? His eyes will be... Whoa. Super dark. Um, okay. Uh, let's see. Let's change it to blue eyes. That's good enough. Let's name him uh, as a tribute to my old channel. He's going to be Mr. Mobby. And uh, I think that's good for now. Let's go ahead and, and do it. Now, uh, this was the random, just a little random world I made. Let's go ahead and create a new world. And uh, all the seeds can be, like, if I make a world, anyone else can go in it. Okay, so if you want my world, if you think it's awesome in the future, let's go ahead and just make a random no number for it. Let's put a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine. <laughs> and we'll just name it um, YouTube World. YouTube World. So let's go ahead and do this. Um, I I know how to play a little bit. I played for like three hours yesterday, so I know the basics. Like uh, I know exactly what to do. I know you spawn next to a city and stuff like that. So while I'm playing, I will just recap what I know. So this is the Rand of Duratar. I love this game. So it is in closed alpha right now. So it is definitely not perfect, but damn, it's so good to play already. So let's look at the map. The first town is going to be right there. We're going to head over there just so I can like see what it looks like and stuff. You can At the town, there is usually a farm area where you can go ahead and um, get your first piece of, pieces of items. So before I start, let's see my skills. I can become a berserker or I can go to gardens. Now, remember, in the f it, it only has minor changes, like the thing at the, the last thing right here. But uh, in the future, they want to add even more advanced skill trees and more classes. So right now, let's just choose between Guardian and Berserker. Uh, Berserkers jump into the fray to defeat their enemies with furious strikes. Your enemy, your attack speed is increased with each hit. That's cool. Guardians withstand the hardest attacks and biggest enemy crowds. They are well suited to avert damage from allies. Your health is increased by 25 if you're a Guardian. Your shield block lasts twice as long as normal. Additionally, you can parry you can parry damage with all weapons. Let's see. Do I want to go crazy or guardian? Guardian. So if I choose guardian, you choose. Uh, let's see. All right, we're gonna choose guardian. So he's uh, he's like that already, unless you want to learn this. So he's already specialized in berserker. So we go ahead and do stuff. Now uh, there's lots of different um, types of weapons you can use. I'm using this mace right here. Oh, am I charging this up? Bam! Oh, what is that? Raccoon! Jesus, raccoon. Oh my god, it's, it's, it's a red... Ah! His... Oh my god, okay. That raccoon, it, it, though very cute, is so deadly. You can tell because his name is Red. That means I am not suited to defeat him right now. So let's run away. Maybe he'll stop chasing me. Oh my god, cow, cow, cow. Jump, 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 jump! Oh, Jesus. I really hope he loses attention soon. <laughs> so, like I said before, this is going to be my single player character. Um, maybe episode 15 to 20 minutes. Oh my god, what the hell? What's happening? Something's fighting! <gasps> what are those? Those... Okay, they destroyed a cow. They just destroyed a cow. I don't know if they're friendly or not. Because uh, in this world... They can, oh god, I fell. They can either be friendly or not friendly, and I don't want to go near them. So, uh, you can tell by their names if they're easy to kill or not. Blue is pretty easy. Oh god, he's chasing me! Raccoon, go away! So, screw the raccoon. Oh my god. Oh my god, the raccoon is beating him. Okay, you know what? Maybe they'll get him low enough so I can finish him off. Let's see. Let's fight. I don't know if, like, animals drop stuff if other animals kill them. Oh my god. Oh, I'm gonna go for the finishing blow. <gasps> they, do, they do drop stuff. Alright, alright. No, no, no. I want some of this. I want some of this action. I want some of this action. Oh, yeah. I took 10 XP for that. 
So I don't know how my skill works. Okay, so every time you hit, it, look, it looks like you charge a mana, and then you can right click, it charges up, and then you let go and hit. That's a pretty good attack. Now each weapon has their own specialty like that. I think, let's see what's this. I picked up a recipe, uh, power 24 for mage. I can't use it, so I'll sell the recipe. Um, if you have a recipe that's for your class and you have the requirements, all you gotta do is right click it and you learn the crafting skill forever. Let's look at my inventory. I can either use, uh, what do I have? A great mace or two iron swords. I'm gonna go ahead and use two iron swords. I think it's only, yeah, two, right? Hell yeah. I think you can do a wield. See, look at that double hit. And then, uh, right click spins, but it doesn't do enough damage unless you have the uh, other stuff. So, let's see. So, if I use one, it does the same thing. I guess the only advantage would be if you have two of the same one, but if you have one weaker one and one other one, it sucks. So, heading towards the town, and um, because, like I said, closed alpha, it's still very fun, and I'm glad I bought it. Um, there's only some stuff you can do. Um, I think you, you can level up infinitely, but you have you have only so much skills. You can tame a pet, and go climbing, swimming, sailing, hang gliding, and ri you can even ride your pet. It's pretty insane. Smash! You jump to a selected spot and smash your enemies. That's pretty cool. Cyclone, you spin around for 5 seconds, so it's like a year narrow or drag or not if you ever played Dota. Um, and then we have War Frenzy. Special attacks are charging faster. Awesome. So, oh yeah, cool, cool warrior. I mean, I think if I if we get around to doing the multiplayer game with my friend soon, I'll try to be a ranger unless, unless someone wants it, and then, I, I, and then I'll go mage. So let's go into town and uh, let's see what I can do. I have 5 potions on me. Oh god, what's that? Lizard man, okay, they're, they're all good. They're all good. You are looking strange. You're looking strange, lizard man. Do I know you? No. Oh, yeah. Since I'm like really low on health, you can go in the inn. Well, you can go in any bed actually that you find in the world. Um, let's see, where is the upstairs? So you can go in and go ahead and lay down and you sleep. Time in the game goes by really slow unless you're sleeping. See, look at the time right there. It's 9.51. It's going, you know, it's not really moving up. You sleep, you gain HP, but look at the time. It's starting to move a lot faster, but it's still pretty slow compared to, um, Sleeping in like what the Sims or something like that. So uh, once it hits nighttime around maybe eighteen hundred or nineteen hundred, um, it's gonna go dark and like really dark. Oh my god, get up, get up, get up. So uh, I don't have any. I have fourteen experience because I like <laughs> I got the last shot on that. Um, what was it? The raccoon. The raccoon didn't really drop anything. The cow dropped the um, recipe though, so that's cool. So each town, actually. I don't know about each town. I've only been to the first town on my uh, playthrough, and uh, I don't know like if other towns later on differ. What's this? Okay, let's go ahead and collect all the what are these pineapples? Cool. So um, there's lots of crafting you can do in this game. I think it's pretty awesome and innovative. Um, so there's different stuff, uh, different crafting tiers that need that require ingredients and a. Um, uh, what do I want to say? Catalyst? Not a catalyst. They require um, some kind of place to actually craft them. So, for instance, if you want to make some kind of foods, you need to do it near a campfire. Um, oh my god, my, my chair is all squeaky. Oh, it's not my chair, it's the pineapples. I can't carry any more of these. How much am I carrying? I am carrying about 50. Holy crap. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. let's go ahead and craft this. Um, so, these are all my learned ones already. I know how to make uh, pineapple slices. So let's go ahead and craft it. See on the bottom left, um, it takes. You can craft this with actually like like some are some recipes are so basic you can craft it without um, anything near it. So these pineapple slices they're very weak but very handy. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, you can use for foods you need like a campfire or something. If you want to make like clothing you need like a loom or a spinning wheel. Uh, weapons obviously need like. Iron ingots or silver or emerald. Um, you need a furnace to uh, get those equipment, and you also need the recipe. You can buy it from shops or pick them up from uh, enemies. This game is really cool. Um, I can't wait to do multiplayer. I the cap right now was only up to four people in one world, and uh, it's really really awesome because um, the creators are they they want to experiment with more open world stuff like huge servers with like you know upwards of hundreds to two hundred people in it. I do, and uh, one thing that I'm not aware of is I don't know how big the maps are. Let me keep picking up stuff. I don't know how big the map can get, uh, but the farther you go away from your initial spawn point, uh, see, you always spawn near a town just because to help you out, but once you go a little bit farther away, um, enemies become increasingly harder. And right now, the only kind of RPG stuff they have besides leveling up is dungeon raiding and just random um, big boss encounters. 
Am I running away from the town? I am. Let's go that way. So what I mean is you can go into a... Here, let me just show you on the map. You see these, uh, I think you, the crosswords, right? You go to them and they're actual missions. It can either be like huge mountains or uh, underground catacombs or a castle. And it tells you to, uh, it gives you an objective like defeat this, you know, clear all the monsters. And you get like special premium coins that you can only get from missions. It's really, really awesome. I know I'm doing a lot of explaining, but hey, you gotta do it, right? So check this out. This is a collie. Can I kill it? No, in towns you can't really fight anything. Um, if I had the right item, you can tame a collie. And they can become your pet and then get fight with you. Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> on my other character, I'm not gonna lie, um, he's so cool. I played him for a little bit. And I think on that character, like, like everyone should have a pet. I think on my character, I'm because I, I, I tamed a couple of, um, I tamed a couple of uh, pets already, but I'm gonna stick with the turtle. It's so cool. Whenever he attacks, he does like a spinning move. He goes right towards you. It's so cool. Um, so we are in the middle of the city, f middle of the city. Finally, I want to go ahead and, well, I don't actually have money, so I'm just going to go here and just run past it. Let's run towards this thing. Cause it's, it's pretty close to the city, so it might not be too hard to go in and fight and stuff. And I am a warrior, so head first and all that stuff. It's going to be hard to kite enemies. Cool. Look at this double sword. I kind of want to use a great sword. I don't want to use the mace. I never like using maces in games. It's whatever. On my other character, the rogue, I'm doing uh, actual fisticuffs, so he actually has like gloves you can put on. They attack really fast. They're weak, but they hit so fast. It's it's pretty awesome. So uh, once I get more money and more stuff to sell, we'll come back here and uh, get more items. Right now, I'm okay. I have 50 life. I mean, not 50. Five life potions and pineapple slices. Now, let me tell you something a little different between pineapple slices and uh, life potions. Potions, you can they heal you and you can eat it on the run while you're fighting. Like if you're in a pinch, you gotta run away and, and like chug it up. But if you have um, food that you make, like pineapple slices, you have to sit down and eat it. It's more like for after battle stuff. So uh, let's keep going. So I'm in the trade district. Let's get out of here. Let's head towards that thingy. So it's gonna be just straight east. Let's follow the uh, map and we'll head over there. Uh, so uh, oh wait, I should have went. No, no, let's go back in the city. My bad. Um. I actually do want to buy something. It's really cheap. Um, I want to go to the pet store. Yeah, there's a, there's an actual pet store. And um, I think I can zoom in so it can tell me where it is. Yeah, let's see. Do any of these look like the pet store? And one one on the right. I think that's it. Is this the pet store? I can't see it. Um, no, that's the... Tr that's the... I can't read that. It's a little scissors. Oh, this is a place where you can refine items and stuff. Crafting district. No, no, no. I want to go into the pet store and I want to buy actual stuff that you can um, tame that uh, tame uh, tame crap with. Where is it at? Where is that store? This is the weapon store. Um, should be okay. I have these starting items. I don't need to buy anything new yet because my power so low. I wouldn't be able to use anything awesome anyway. But I just want to get like the basic. I know you can buy like a carrot and cotton candy and um, only some. Um, Enemies, not enemies. Some neutral mobs are tamed by it. You have to have the right one. I don't know all of them. I know some of them. Um, and I don't really want to spoil it. I want to like experiment for myself and see what I can actually have. So, um, do, 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 do. let's sell this iron shield. Shield? Yeah, I'm not going to use a shield. I'm going to use two handed um, weapons. What happened to my. There it is. Sell that. What else do I want to sell? Yes, this is for mages. I don't want that. Um, okay, we'll keep the rest. Let's go ahead and buy it. Why is that green and this isn't? I don't understand. Light iron lamp. Um, why is it green? Whatever, I'll, I'll use it. It's green. I don't know why. Maybe it goes brighter than the other one. Huh? Must be cool, right? I mean, it must be. Must be something cool. So, uh, bubble gum, pet food. Oh yeah, well, here's the here's where you can buy the wood boat and the hang glider and all that stuff. Glass flask. I need those. Um, you can use these. Use glass flask to make water flask, combine it with mushrooms that you find in the wild, and you can make more potions. And uh, once you learn recipes, you can make even more powerful potions. So, let's see what else I want. Bubble gum. They only have bubble gum. I don't know who wants bubble gum. So, I can buy uh, formulas here too. Okay. Um, I don't think they have any more pet food. They have a lot of formulas, but look at that. It all requires more power. That is, that's more leveling up. So, the only thing they have here is... Um, Oh wait, I can buy bombs. Yeah, I'll buy bombs. 
bombs you can use to break certain certain items in the world. You can't break everything, but sometimes you come across like an obstacle. You need to break down, and you gotta have bombs for that. So how much bombs can I purchase? Seventeen. That's so much. Okay. So I have bubblegum, and I'm not gonna lie, I have never used bubblegum before, so I don't know what you can use to tame it. I mean, I don't know what you can tame it with, but we'll find out together. Do 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 do. I know that I'm doing a lot of talking, but hey. I'm just recapping everything I learned, and this game is so great. So, uh, let's go ahead and, uh, let's test this thing out. What is that? That's a pig. Do you like candy? So, to go to your equipment and throw out the bubble gum. They'll look at you, and if they will, if they, if they want it, they'll be eating it, and then you tame them right away. One thing I didn't learn, though, is I don't know how to, um, do you, do you like the candy? Do you like the candy kitty? No? Oh, screw you then. So, I don't know how to rename them. You can rename them freely. Uh, I didn't figure out how. I'm just gonna hold the candy on me. Uh, I might run into another um, tameable mob soon. Okay, what's that? Oh, is that another pig? Great. You can't attack anything in towns. What's that? Nothing. Okay, let's keep going. So, like I said before, I'm gonna head towards the. Uh, where is that? Um, it was east, wasn't it? East. Yeah, let's go east. We we'll head towards that thing, and uh, maybe we'll level up along the way. I mean, the first level, second level doesn't take too much, as you can see. One one guy I got gave me 14 experience, but that was because what's this? That was because uh, the cows freaking helped me kill him. Pumpkins. All right, pumpkins. You can make pumpkin um, pumpkin slices, pumpkin pies or slices, and it's it's a little bit better. Let's go ahead and collect these. I don't know the recipe for it. I think yet. So, but yeah, let's grab them. It's free food, man. You gotta do it. And if you don't. Know, Need some extra money you can sell it later, I guess. Uh, I don't know if these respawn, but what's what's really ah? Uh, what's that? Oh my god, is that a witch? Oh, hello, witch. That's cool. Okay, so east is where I'm going. Yeah, let's go tame my first pets. Where is he? Pet, pet, pet. What's that? Cotton plant. So you break these, and ha, you break that, and you get um stuff to you know basically craft items with. So that's cool. You have to actually go around the world. You're not. It's not like Minecraft where you're mining stuff. I really hope in the future though, because they don't have actual player houses yet, where you can like purchase a place and like decorate it. I don't know if they're gonna do that. I, you know, I want them to, but that it doesn't have to be as extensive as Minecraft, but a nice place to put stuff in and redecorate. Okay, I should I should really have checked his um charge this up. Oh, nice. Before you fight, you usually want to check their uh, skill. Like this guy, he's uh, he's blue, so I can, I can handle it easy. He only gave me one XP, but it doesn't matter. Oh my god, I fell! <laughs> Let's go, stupid fly. See, if I had a pet, he'd be helping me fight. Charge it up. Oh yeah, oh, they hit a lot. Not bad. So, Berserker. So every... Is it, like, working already? Let's see. Your attack speed is increased with each hit. So the longer I hit... The longer I fight something... The, the, the faster it'll hit? Well, let's test that out here. I won't use my special, let's just keep hitting them and we'll see just how faster I get. Does it look like it's getting faster? I'm not sure, I think it is. Ooh, nice. Oh my god, that fly is a... Uh, that fly is a little orangey. His name, I mean. It's okay, I got him. <laughs> oh my god, he's not dead yet. Finish it! Oh, that didn't even hurt him. Wow, I picked up leftovers, power 10. What's leftovers? I never picked that up before. Um, leftovers is in the... Where is it at? It's in the items tab. Power 10. I don't know what you can do with that. Power 10. So maybe you can equip it. I'm not sure. So let's go ahead and eat some of the pineapple slices. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> so um, that was my introduction into Cube World for you guys. There's going to be a lot more of this. Do not worry. But uh, just let me know. Are you guys really excited to see more of this? I know you've probably, because it's been in closed beta already, closed alpha already, uh, you've probably seen videos of it, but this is my own little take, and remember, I'm going to be doing live streams with another character, so please follow me at twitch.tv slash Um I'm going to do, I think, every, you know, I do I do don't solve every day, but I'll do this every other day at least, probably even every day, depending on how many I do. So do you want to see a lot more of this? And stay tuned for the multiplayer one, which I'll help my friends play. So thanks so much for being here. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like. It helps so much more than you know. Comment on anything that you want. I'll make sure to reply as fast as I can. These guys are going to die. And um, if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I upload a lot of daily videos. Thanks so much for being here. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time. Oh, Jesus. Jeez, jeez, Jesus. Whoa. Oh, my God. Oh, God. I hit like a freaking... Ah. Oh.
Oh my god, I, I really I forgot to check if um all my if my, my weapons came with me. Um yeah, squire sword and the helm. I bought those two, right? I think I bought those two, so I should be okay. Uh 